Bill Nye the Science Guy. Say hello to our little friend. Potato guns are essentially using physics in two different parts. The combustion and then the energy and momentum formed by it. I'm going to talk about kinetic energy, which is the motion of the potato exiting out the barrel, um, based off of the potential energy that is stored from the combustible hairspray, which we use, inside that all gets stored in the chamber. Then when it gets lit on fire, the, ra the gases rapidly expand causing the pressure to launch the potato out, connect, changing everything to kinetic energy. Kinetic energy also has a lot of momentum. Momentum equal ouch. Wow. Let's do that again. <laughs> After shooting our final launch, we figured out we could do some math and we could find an angle using the uh, recording that we used. So we figured out that the distance from our launch position to the birdhouse that we shot at was 22 meters and we calculated a time of 0.5 seconds, total flight time. So using uh, D equals VT, we could solve for a initial V velocity of 44 meters per second. Using, um, assuming the potato went 1 meter, um, max height and with time of 0.5 seconds assuming acceleration is gravity we could use a uh, d equals vi or vt plus one half at squared and when we solve that equation we boil down we get our y component to be 2.8 meters per second and then if we take an inverse tangent of the two velocities we get a theta of <laughs> that's like the worst thing I could have we get an invert, we get a theta of 0 0.068 degrees. <sighs> so we calculated our momentums and our energies, and using our mass of a potato, it's just a rough estimate, of 0.146 kilograms, we plugged it into P equals MV, and we got um, 6.424 momentums. Um, and then next we calculated a kinetic energy using our velocities and our mass. And using one half mv squared, we calculated 141.33 joules. And then, knowing that a paintball hurts, but it doesn't injure you, um, we used a paintball versus a potato momentum problem. And we found a paintball weighing roughly uh, 0 0.03375 kilograms. And we used a rough estimate of about 100 meters per second. And then we set it equal to the other half, which would be the same down there. And then we got uh, a momentum of 3.375 for the paintball, which is roughly a half of what the potato would be. So uh, in retrospect, the potato hurt twice as much. Same face. So we wanted to calculate a maximum distance that our little potato feller is gonna fly. We did some calculations. Using our 44 uh, meters per second, uh, we calculated um, that a total time for the flight of said potato would be 4.272 seconds. So we used uh, d equals vt, and we calculated that our uh, our potato is going to launch at a max distance of 109 meters.
lands. Order. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I want to redo on that one. We're a piece. <laughs>